Well, tourists usually love to see icebergs off the shores of Newfoundland and Labrador, but for cruise ships, icebergs can be nothing but a nuisance. Cornerbrook is seeing a big delay in scheduled visits with four cancellations already this season. Here and now's Colleen Connors explains how those bergy bits are to blame. This is the prime location to watch cruise ships come into the port of Cornerbrook. But for the fourth time, the port of call has been canceled again today. And that's all because of the drift ice limit off the coast of Newfoundland and Labrador. So what is a drift ice limit? Um, essentially, this is a limit that's based on the amount of ice and growlers and uh, just the, the, the water type that's uh, around Newfoundland and Labrador at the moment. The Canadian Ice Service provides detailed and timely maps indicating the ice conditions in the Gulf of St. Lawrence and how south it travels. Vessels like the Regent Seven Seas Navigator use extreme caution during iceberg season because of waters that look like this. Typically, ships will stay 30 to 60 nautical miles south of the iceberg limit. The Navigator is not an expedition-type vessel. When you look at the way a ship is built, it really depends on the quality of the, um, the, the hull. So some ships are specifically built to, to navigate icy waters, and of course some ships are not. There is always a risk that weather can play a factor this early in the cruise ship season, but the port never turns away a cruise call. Four missed cruise ship visits has a big effect on the tourism market, especially for bus operators, cab companies, and local vendors. When we see a call cancel, um, we quickly try to communicate that cancellation as quick as possible because I know people have done lots of things to prepare for that visit. The Regent Seven Seas Navigator that can hold 496 passengers will keep trying to dock in Cornerbrook on its tour through New England and the east coast of Canada. Hartley says that her fingers are crossed for another port of call scheduled for June 30th. And this is shaping up to be the busiest cruise ship season for Cornerbrook with almost 30 ships coming in and almost 42,000 tourists expected. Colleen Connor, CBC News, Cornerbrook.